according to Gareth, we've got the most extreme track we've seen in 30 years. Any thoughts on that? We'll see when we're out there. You never know until you're out there, really. Depends how bad it gets when you're riding. You've got to just go with it. You seen the track? Yep. What do you think? Gonna love it. You're gonna love it. You scared of any bit of it? Nope. So you just bring it on, yeah? Yep. Bring it on and see what happens. Gareth is telling us that it's the most extreme track in 30 years. Any thoughts? Well, I think I rode my first one here 37 years ago, so I'll probably remember the extreme ones, won't I? <laughs> <laughs> you seen the track? Yeah, yeah. what do you think? Uh, hard. You think it's going to be hard, yeah? yeah? You ready for it? Not really. Not really? What have you done to prepare for it? Uh, I've been training. Have you? What have you been doing? Uh, beach riding. Beach riding? Get in. What, what, how are you going to get on? Do you think you're going to win? Uh, yeah. Yeah, had a boy. Cool. All right, have a good day, yeah? First year doing it, so we'll have a go on it. So you've chosen a year to come and do it. Gareth is telling us that this is the most extreme Western in 30 years. I mean, how do you feel about that? Give it a go, it's the worst that can happen. The track, well, from what we've seen, looks really, really soft. It doesn't look packed down, so it's really, really soft sand. Any strategies to how you're gonna handle that on the sidecar? Well, try and keep the front as light as we can and just keep the power on, because as soon as you stop, you, you know, let the throttle off, you're gonna stop dead. You know, the soft sand is a killer for us, really. Have you done anything to get yourself ready for Western, or have you done anything differently this year? Just practicing on sand tracks, mate, down the local tracks, um, doing more endurance instead of motocross races. So I do a lot of enduro races on the weekends. So that's about it, really, doing three hour enduros and try and just get my stamina up. Have you? Uh, what have you done to prepare for yourself for Western then? I had about 10 pints of Guinness last night. Um, I'll probably have 12 tonight, I think. <laughs> and then maybe 14 Saturday night. What have you done to sort of uh, get yourself ready for today? Picked up a bike two days ago. Not rode in about nine months. Um, my only preparation is that I've done Western before. That's it. <laughs> All right, well, good luck, mate. Take care. <laughs> How are you? How have you sort of prepared yourself for Western this year? Lost a few pounds. <laughs> <laughs> so, what's your prediction? Where are you coming? Uh, the last two years I've raced it, I've got 380. So I'm trying to, I'm trying to beat the top 300. So I'll be happy if I get top 300. Nice. Well, listen. Good luck, and uh, I hope to see you out there. You'll see us on the podium, mate. I, I hope so. <laughs>